2024 Storm Team Chief Meteorologist John Bryant with the Mid-South's most accurate forecast. All right, good evening, everybody. Let's get right to it because it is a busy night. We have heavy rain in the metro area right now. Aerial flood advisory issued. Uh, there's still a lot of leaves around that are in the uh, drains, and that's clogging up uh, the runoff uh, and not letting the water escape as fast as it could otherwise. So Lakeland, Bartlett, heavy rain right now. Aerial flood advisory for all of Shelby County. Be careful driving tonight. If you are driving, stay in those middle lanes instead of the curb lanes where the drains are. All right, tornado watch for a good bit of eastern Arkansas until 10 p.m. Would not be surprised if additional watches are issued. Uh, there is a risk of severe weather everywhere. The orange is the highest, and that includes the Memphis Metro, an enhanced a three on a scale of one to five. And all of this tan area is a risk of a tornado. So everybody has a chance tonight. And the winds are starting to pick up as well, gusting uh, out of the south-southeast at about 25 to 30 miles per hour. So that southeast wind is one of concern. It makes uh, things turn a little bit more in the atmosphere. And the more turning, the more likely of a tornado. Also watching this area down here in Louisiana near the Arklatex, uh, back here and this area in uh, central Mississippi moving north. That could be an area of concern uh, as well as the evening goes along. This is 10 o'clock tonight. Notice a strong line of storms crossing the Mississippi River. But that doesn't mean we're over and done. There's another one that will develop about midnight and be right on the Mississippi River. That is the actual cold front itself, and that'll march on through uh, the eastern half of the area in between 12 and 3 a.m. So that is that after that point, once that passes, will be clear and uh, not have to worry about severe weather anymore and wake up to numbers tomorrow morning. That will be in the 40s. And really, tomorrow should be a quiet day. Clouds are going to increase tomorrow night. And for Thanksgiving, folks, there is a chance of rain uh, in the northern counties in the morning and then in the rest of the area uh, Thursday afternoon and evening, but nothing too severe. And as far as travel across the country, Chicago, there could be some problem areas. This is Wednesday now. Atlanta over to Charlotte. Uh, even D.C., the big cities, uh, if your flight's early, you're probably better off. And the West Coast, there could be some issues. But getting out of Memphis, you should be okay. This weather should be gone and out, although uh, it will be breezy. So there's a look at your travel picture. 50, uh, the overnight low in Memphis tonight. Storms likely, some of those severe. 55 for a high tomorrow. Calm weather, though. Nice to say that and enjoy it because showers are back for Thanksgiving Day and Black Friday, and on Saturday, we could have another round of strong to perhaps severe storms, so that's a day to watch. Anytime you go from 70 to 45, you gotta have a heads up on that, and we will. Um, so hopefully we can get through tonight unscathed, but you need to stay weather aware because I think the uh, strongest of the storms are just about to start to enter part of the area, so it could, could make for a long evening.